Hello, hello viewer, welcome to my new playthrough. This game is called Home, in case you couldn't read. Home is a fan game of the game Off. You might know that I've already done a playthrough of that, so I've been looking forward to this one. Because in this one, apparently, you play as the judge. The smiling cat that we all know and love. So, with that being said, let me see, there are save files. But yeah, this is, uh, this is a finished product. Apparently there's still some bugs, but hopefully we won't come across too many. So let's just start the game. In the end. In the beginning. Your name is Jake. Right? Yeah. Okay then. Welcome, Jake. You have been assigned to a being called the Judge. Look at him sleeping. That's adorable. Your job is to watch over the Judge. The Judge is an important figure. He is a guide, but also a guardian. He is the guardian of Zone Zero. The world has changed. Your role, however, has not. Your game begins here. This music sounds familiar. It's like a MIDI version of a Silent Hill song that I heard once. Forgot where it's from. Greetings, Jake. It appears that our precious judge is still asleep. To interact with objects in the environment, press the enter key. For this instance, use it to wake up our guardian. Perfect. He is now awake. Who goes there? Speak up, intruder. No need to be alarmed, Judge. You knew this day would come. You've known since the beginning. Today is the dawn of your role as a puppet. It's your turn to become a marionette for the new world. Jake is your puppeteer. Hmm. Welcome, Jake. I've been waiting for some time for your arrival. To move him around, use the arrow keys. Press left to test this movement. Perfect. On to your next key lesson. To view the database of your new puppet, press the escape key. Or X. I prefer Z and X. Just personally. Okay, so we still have competences, objects, and all that stuff. Good, you learned fast. We will speak again, Jake. For now, you will be left alone. Jake, it appears someone has just arrived. If it is of a reasonable request, please guide me to the stairs placed before me. It appears that it is not capitalized there in the beginning. I'm not going to be too petty about spelling errors and stuff. Wow, Judge. Those are some pretty sick ladder climbing skills you got there. Okay. So... I think this game is an alternate point of view to off, maybe? Or... Well... Maybe it somehow happens afterwards, I don't know. So, a mysterious figure has decided to place himself before me. Such a creature to invade my precious personal zone. Nevertheless, I'll introduce myself. I'm the judge, and I'm aching to know your name, dear capped man. I'm the batter. I've been assigned to a sacred mission. I don't remember the batter having a uh, dialogue noise. That's interesting. It has come to my attention that I am in need of your help. Sacred mission. If your mission is so sacred, then why are you in need of my help? The world beyond the zone is corrupt. I must purify it. However, I have noticed a spirit around you. Shall I purify said spectre controlling you? Their name is Jake. They can't talk to us. However, they can hear and see everything. I am delighted to have you here, Jake. Nevertheless, explain why your sacred mission led you here. This zone has been deserted for years. You have something I need. For if I am to purify the world, I need a zodiac card to proceed. Well then, co coincidence has it that today yours truly has such an item I believe you are looking for. You gave the batter a zodiac card. Hey! This is a nice little item graphic. That's cool. I wish you the best of luck, foolish purificator. 
Your laudable quest is rather impossible, but do not let me stop you from such endeavors. Yeah. Thanks. Is he wearing something orange this time? What's the significance of that? Just my mic? There we go. Okay, we can move around. Loot. Luck ticket. I like these item graphics. Piece of silver flesh. Mmm. It's like chicken. It's down here. Nothing, probably. Yeah. Uh, anything? Gotta be something. I don't know what I'm doing. Anyway. I guess we can go through here. Hmm. An interesting man. His quest is noble yet impossible to accomplish. No doubt his intrusions on the land will land him in a morgue. A sad funeral no one will even visit. What a shame. What do you think, Jake? Might I inquire to your plans as an omnipotent guardian of the land? Ah, but alas, you can't speak to me. A rather inaccurate display of raw competence. How about we use that cerebrum of yours? Complete the puzzles on this island, or else you'll be stuck, wandering endlessly across these yellow lands. Sounds like a plan. Aha, this is one of those puzzles. I'm glad he thought to teleport the box when he hit it down there. I seem to have gone in a loop. Okay, that wasn't the right place to hit it. Hold on. Let's go up here and try this. I personally think it would be a little better if the box was just moved down a little bit so it's level with the judge's feet little cat paws. Oh! Huh? Okay, is this a... Uh... This is one of those follow the star puzzles, I think. Where did he go? There we go. Hey! Okay. I forgot. Um, not down there. Here we go. I love Simon Says. The door opens somewhere. Drag my keyboard. Because the desk is digging into my arms. Stone is impossible to move. There's the door. Hold on. Okay. Wait. Excellent job, Jake. Your ability of touching and pawing at various stones is impressive. Now, let us flick this switch. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Jake. Something is wrong, Jake. My skull throbs and aches in the most violent manner. Your time is coming, Judge. This land is crumbling before your very eyes. Will you sit back and do nothing? The guardians of this land have failed their jobs. What will you do? The choice is yours. Something is terribly wrong, Jake. Okay, I think this does take place after off, because... You know, purified lands and everything. It is apparent that I have been chosen to repair that which has been distraught and broken. <sighs> the northern door placed before us is the way we must go. Let us make our haste towards the next destination. Okay. Here is an accessory that is going to be especially helpful on our quest, dear enlightened one. 
This non-forming red cube hovering before us is a valuable ally within itself. Aside from rendering me the entirety of my health and competence points, it is capable of saving our progress and sending us to the nothingness. The nothingness is a limbo portal between the zones that divide our world. Do not worry, I travel a lot through the different zones of the world, dear Jake. It is not a harmful device. Let us carry on towards the destination that is Zone 1. The Guardian there must be warned. Must be warned. Hmm? Guess I'll save on block one. Look at all the cats. Look at all the strange smiley cats. I like the... Ooh. This is quite interesting. In fact, I like it better than off. <laughs> the world map, I mean. And so far, this game is... In terms of technicalities and artwork, it's getting up there. Okay, I guess we should go warn. What's his name? Deedon? Yeah, let's go warn Deedon. Why is everyone wearing colors now? Welcome to Elson. This vehicle is the train. It's really useful. Yeah, okay. Uh, uh, another visitor? Another? I, um, uh, welcome to the smoke mines. Uh, may I know who you are? Are you someone's pet? No, I'm the judge. I'm the guardian of Zone Zero. Have you heard of Zone Zero? The judge? Guardian? What is a cat doing here anyways? What does a judge do? My fine humanoid sack of meat I want to protect my land, and to do so, I am looking for the Guardian of Zone 1. I... who sent you? Nobody sent me. I came here on my own regard. Jake is the one eating my actions. Uh, I don't know them. They sound very important, though. Um, you're at the smoke mines of Damien, the southern part of Zone 1. Here we send workers into details to unearth metal from the ground, bringing embedded smoke that was trapped in the depths. Enough explanatory chatter. I know how the situation of existence is itself works. There is no need to wither my ears off with your chatter. All I need to know is where the Garden of Zone 1 is. I need to speak with him. Um, he might be past the mines, but they're blocked off at the moment. Sorry, I can't help you. What is a feline doing in Damien? I don't know. A luck ticket has been found. Du, 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 du. Clearly different music here. There's the batter. Ugh. Have you spotted the chief of the specters? By what do you mean? I'm deeply sorry to speak the truth, for neither man nor ghost has been spotted around here. Ugh. Hmm. Do you know where he might be? I just arrived here and have not a clue where such a being might be. Phantasmagorial beings? It seems that phantoms have appeared before us. Jake, do you possess the knowledge to grapple and battle such foes? No! I am perfectly capable. These guys look like they mean business, though. Zero! I like his little grin here. Does anyone hope to defeat the judge? 
He smiles because he knows that no one can now that I'm taking control. Waking Ravage. What is that? Yeah. Took you long enough. I'm deeply sorry that I do not make a living out of Spectre Slang. Maybe you could have aided Jake instead of standing there holding your bat in such a mundane and pointless manner. Yeah. Not my problem. Well, there are no more Spectres down here. My mission guides me onwards. I'll see you later, Judge. Goodbye. Minor, okay. There should be a save point nearby. I think I'll be fine. What? <laughs> what was with that laugh? Ghosts recently came out of the mines. They're not safe. I'm fully aware of this. Out of nowhere came this man. He struck the specters with what looked to be a bat. Much to my surprise, the spirit let out a yell as it vanished out of existence. Here I thought the specters were untouchable. Very well then, I must be going. Be, um, be safe in there. Dangerous cats are also spotted down there. You could do something about them. You're a cat yourself, right? This guy knows his elements. Who's this? Oh. Cats have been spotted in the mines as if the phantoms were enough trouble. What's wrong with cats? A man holding a bat was mumbling about the chief of the specters. Lamps don't always work in the endmost corridors since everything looks like There are phantoms in every corner. Be careful in there. Besides, who will let you enter here? Normally, the regulation prohibit external visitors, let alone a cat. Well, I'm a special cat, so screw you, buddy. Who was that? I think that was the same cat. Okay, yeah, I knew there was a save point nearby, so I didn't use a luck ticket. <clears throat> Smoke. Oh boy. These look like... Um... These are RTP monsters, aren't they? I recognize this. Ah! That is a clever idea. Instead of, you know, putting in miss, you know, quote unquote miss, he actually made it zero. I actually never thought of that. That's interesting. Always the little things, though. I'm being productive. Please let me work. Oh, he is actually moving. A little hard to see, but you can see it. The Joker has been found. I like that there's actually smoke coming out. These cats do not look very nice. Come on, Judge. I've already been having this problem and off. Batter kept missing all the time. Good job. How much until the next level? Not too much, I guess. There's our cat. Let me just explore a little more in case that's a cutscene. Um, what's... Okay. Do it. Yep, I remember this. We're safe here, but we'll have to escape once we run out of meat. Maybe, maybe we can eat you? No. What did you open the door for? The pictures are gonna kill us. Shove off, cat. Get out of here. Shut up. You people do not know who I am. Lyle's meat. What is that again? Here's furious and madness. I see. I'm the superior cat here, buddy. Get out. The 
so much smoke trapped within these rocks. Beautiful smoke, please come out to play. Smoke fetishist. Come back, fiend! What? How are people making it through the smoke mines? Did a young bat brandishing a bat come by? Why, why yes, he said he was looking for a certain chief of the specters. He seemed rather lost. Yes, yes, he is certainly a man of few words and even fewer brain cells. Can you tell me the direction in which he traveled? Uh, I can't. Just why not? Who are you? Have you been sent by the queen? Or by Deedon? Deedon? Uh, yes, that is the guardian of the zone. I, I've said too much. I get fired. Dismiss from mind of this conversation. Tell me where the batter went. He, uh, he... We have, uh, specters in our big barns. <clears throat> he went to cleanse them. Barns. Uh, yes, to the right. Very well, then. Thank you much for the information of much value. Read that wrong. Ugh. These boulders don't get any lighter, so heavy. I'm kind of busy here. Yeah, I can see that. A sound of tears. Ooh. It's nice to work out here rather than the smoke mines. The air is so much better. I'm sorry I can't let you through right now. I wonder if it's even worth talking to these guys. A little tired of their antics. Oh, this color on Deedon too, it looks like. <laughs> Hello there, sir. What the fuck is going on here? A man came by. He's inside the barns right now. He he said he would help with the specters. How long has a shit stain been poking around in there? Not long. Of course, you know nothing. Worthless piles of crud. He, he will eliminate the specters. Of all the stupid, idiotic things I've heard today, that takes the cake. Icing and all. Do you think he's better than me? Ain't nobody stronger than me. No, no, I don't think that. Good. We would have to evaluate your position if you dare think that anyone was tougher than me. You're all a bunch of weaklings anyway. This isn't new, but forget it. That man's deader than hell. What? You don't think he'll make it out alive? Of course not. Nobody can fight the specters, except for the envoys of the queen herself. That prig in there is no envoy of her majesty. Who's going to help us rid ourselves of those phantoms? I could have done it myself. I'm not a worthless sack of shit like a lot of you. You're just going to have to deal with it yourselves. I... no... Anyone else want to speak up? His color... <laughs> His color's changed. Didn't think so. I'll be heading to Shachihara. You prigs are to stay here and clean out the meatworks by yourself. Please don't. If I catch you so much as speaking without men inside, I'll have your head. Don't. No. Piss off. Where'd he go? It's my mission to talk to that prick. Brenda. Eh. Okay. <laughs> Does Judge know that that's Deedon? It's so strange you would think me would come from such a plump and fleshy animal. Yeah, whatever. Purification in progress. Adversary is purified. I would like if the battles lasted that long, too. What is with that cat? There must be something over there. Hey, Batter, you forgot this. A thick coat. That wouldn't have done for him anyway. But still, not very observant. Would this be another pushing puzzle? 
Ага. Ah. We did it! A cat all by itself? What a strange sight to see in this loo. I don't know, I forgot how to pronounce that. <laughs> Another cat! No way, you're different! Your grin is wide, teeth so sharp. They're coming. The dead, their unfortunate end, I caused it, now they haunt me. They seek your vibrant flesh, just as I sought theirs. Oh no, cat ghosts. Don't point at me. That's cool. The item spawns above you, and yeah, you saw that. That is a lot better. Alright, what now? You. You erased them. They were once my friends. Guilty as I am their leader, I was in control. I was to lead them to feasts, but I led them to their graves. I can feel them. More are coming. They want you to stay here. Forever. Hey! Take that. Criticals. I love them. This will be a smoother fight, I think. You about done. You, you're strong. You've erased them all. I'm free. Their ghastly bodies no longer haunt me. I need meat. I need it so badly. Give me it all. I'll let you go. I refuse to give in to your demands and feed your devious habits. Such a shame. I'll just eat you instead. Back away, miserable runt. Hey! What's this guy's problem? Get him! Wow. I'm waiting for a skill.
still waiting. I really do like that animation with the item and all. And boom goes the dynamite. Our claw received. Stop, I'm sorry. Everything's so dark. My bones are so empty. My stomach is an abyss. Such a pitiful creature you are. Take me with you. I'll help you out. We can find food together. Please don't let me starve. Given the contingency of this odd predicament, I'll have you join in my inquisition. Jake, certainly you have no quarrels with such a member of my kind joining us. Joining us, right? Who's Jake? I see no one else here. Jake is an omnip omnipotential guardian. He will guide our steps, should you join our travels. Fair enough. I'll join the cat with the funny vocabulary and his imaginary friend. For now. Elaine. Alley cat. What sort of attacks do you have? Okay, he has the leech attack. Well, we've got the first cat in our team. Got two more to go. Okay, let's just go on out and find our save point. So thank you for watching this first episode of Home, a fan game of Off. It's looking pretty nice so far. Obviously, I've already stated that there are certain things that I enjoy in this more than Off. The item animations, for example. Uh, I can tell there's been a lot of effort in this so far, so... I look forward to what happens in the future. Until then, see you later. Awesome, we made it. I think. Yep. Um... I should get going. Flesh. It slices away so nicely. But back away. I must return to work. I'm back. Wow! Blood, such a beautiful substance. Let it flow out in beautiful splashes. <laughs>